In this screencast I want to show you the use of document templates in SAP CRM. To use document templates and fill them with data, you have to create first a web service. I've done so for an activity object. You select for this web service a business transaction. I choose a sub uh, object activity and I use the read functionality. In the next step, I selected attributes uh, which I want to display in my in the web service. And what I did, I especially chosen also from the header data and also uh, address data because I want to display from the parties involved. I want to display some uh, address information. I did that for the uh, main contact and for the contact person. In the next step, for the maintain attributes, you can choose which fields should be included. And then in the final step, you activate this web service. And the most important thing for the document templates to have to set the web service to productive. OK, you finally get a uh, WSDL file. And then that can be used in the document templates. In the document template, I search for the document templates I have on my system and let's choose this line and go to the edit mode. You can then download first the schema and then download the template and that will allow you to edit this in, in Word. So let's start Word on this computer and let's edit our template a bit. Okay, Office Word and here we have activities. To enable the attribute editor you enable the task pane and in the task pane switch to the XML structure. And when I now activate show XML text I see all the elements that I've chosen from my structure which is provided by the web service. Okay, I disable this because if you now save it, this document template and upload it back to CRM. So I did that before and now let's use it in practice. After you uploaded the template, you go for example for a sample activity and in this activity I go to the attachments tab and I can add attachments from my local computer or I can link to an URL but what we need now is a create with template. So I click here and choose the one existing template for activities and now a new template is created and let's see what's done in this template. This template now contains all the fields that I've chosen from the web service uh, filled in here in the, in the table and now I can start continue writing something and saving that back to the document. But unfortunately in Enhancement Pack 1 I have to if I want to edit the document, I have to switch to the Advanced tab and here I have to go to More, Checkout, save it locally and then this is an activity test. Okay, and then uh, I can really open it up. Best regards, Gregor Wolf. Save the document and now I have to upload and check it uh, in again from my local hard drive. Okay, let's browse it and here we are with the activity test and attach it again. And now I've created a new version in the document management as we see here when we look up the version history. So this is uh, a document I've edited. So that was the document created from the template. Okay, that's a CRM. Uh, functionality, uh, standard functionality using web services with document templates uh, to fill or create uh, office documents. Thanks for your attention.